Tommy asks, I got a question. He's got a friend in the fire department wanting to know if we can program a UV 5R to receive and transmit on the fire department frequency. Well, you can. The question is, do you want to? And um, technically, those radios are not type accepted for the radio service that those that the, the fire department public safety frequencies would be in. So mm -hmm. that's that would be a that would be a uh, a concern. I guess my bigger con my bigger concern is that um, you know when I when I think about firefighters and communications is do we really want to re do we really want to trust public safety communications to a thirty dollar radio? Right. And. I get, and I get that, you know, you're a volunteer and you want to be able to listen to the paging channel at home and, and things like that. But, um, you know, it's, where do you, where do you kind of draw the scanners. line? They make scanners for that guy. Yeah. Because then before you know it, you know, you're on the, you're on the scene and you got fire ground or, you know, on and on, on that radio. And it's, um, I don't know. It's, um, yeah. I, I would. I, I I would I would question a department that doesn't provide radios of some sort even to their volunteer firefighters. So yeah, and that's just the thing is that you know for those who are the firefighters, mm -hmm. they will be issued their own radio. Okay, or at least and, or at the very least a pager. Yeah, right, exactly a pager. Right. So if, if you want the program in just to receive only channel uh, yeah sure that's fine as long as we're not running a digital mode which most fire departments don't run digital they're all most at least around here so analog most of them most of them uh, stay analog for the paging because of the paging reason yeah right like um sheriff and police they're running p25 encryption you're not going to get that on a ball thing in fact you're not going to get encryption unless you have an uh, actual like a motorola or a tate or something along those lines something yeah <laughs> Yeah. So that being said, if you just want to listen in and program uh, listen only, that's fine. But again, this gets to the age old question is just because you can doesn't mean you should. Yeah. Yeah. You know, transmit capabilities. And I, I mm -hmm. get it. You guys are going to say, well, what if it's really an emergency? Well, if it's really an emergency, there's a lot better ways to get a hold of someone. Mm -hmm. Just, just is. Yeah. Period. Yeah. End of discussion. Yeah. You know. Yeah. You know, Tony says, you know, the $30 radio is yet to fail a function for me. And, you know, that that's probably the case, too. Um, in, in most circumstances, the radio is going to function just fine. Mm -hmm. But um, it works until it doesn't work. And um, if you're at the if you're at the scene, is that something you're going to want? Is, is that something you want to trust and, and rely on? So I guess I kind of I, 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 I kind of take a little bit of a, you know, being um loosely associated with, um, you know, the, the other side of, of public safety in, in allocating funds and resources for our public safety professionals. I, I, I always want to make sure that they have the best equipment that's, that's available to them. And, um, I, that's why I kind of, feel, that's the, that's the reason why I feel the way, the way that I do and why we spend, you know, geez, $4,000 on a handheld radio for, for, yeah. for, our, for our firefighters. Yeah. So. Yeah, Motorola, Tate, Harris, uh, mm -hmm. Kenwood still has um, uh, Land Mobile. Yeah, I mean they're not cheap, but they're no. not cheap for a reason. But you don't, uh, have, you know, if you're a volunteer, you don't have to spend. You don't have to spend four grand either. There's a lot of there's a lot of stuff like um, you can get a you can get a commercial Kenwood for a few you know a used one for a few hundred dollars. It's yeah, gonna, I got it, that might it, that might even be intrinsically safe. So it's yeah. um. I got one right here. here. Yeah. Right here. This is my P25. Um, I don't put, well, uh, I do have a code plug for um, some frequencies. There's uh, some Mavis channels that are mm -hmm. on here. When I was more active in Aries, that's something that we just had. Um, I also have never used them. I don't even listen to them. In fact, if I ever reprogram it, I'll probably take them off. Yeah. It is. Well, the police, you know, the police stuff you can't even listen to with anymore because you don't have the the the, the encryption, encryption. keys. So. Yeah, two hundred fifty. Unfortunately, 
Yeah, yeah. You're, yeah. Not, you're, not, not, gonna, <laughs> you're not gonna get that. Yep, yep. Yeah, so, yeah, and Tommy, it, Tommy says, I know I've got a set to receive the police and county and the state and would transmit if I had to go back to the chirp and cut, transmit off. Uh, they're just trying to save some money to the fire department. So, yeah. and I get that, you know, some communities are really strapped for cash, especially with these, these small volunteer departments. It's, uh, that's, that's, that's an issue. You know, it's, um, some, you know, some of them, if, if you have to supply, uh, you know, a certain amount of gear, that's, you know, where do you, where do you draw the line? You know, it's, yeah. um, well, I don't you know. know. I would go, I would go to a couple of volunteer I, fire department barbecues. It means they're not using bow fangs. Boots, you know, it's, I um, will stuff know. my face there so they don't have to buy a bow fang. Yeah. If they're spending, yeah, they're, 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 they're paying money for boots and coats, you know, it's, that's probably more yeah. important than the radio, but the radios are also very important too. So yeah. it's, um, yeah. No, that, that's the thing. Yeah. My life, uh, my life is on the line. Uh, uh, please, please don't let it be a bow fang. <laughs> <laughs> yeah no I, I yeah so it's um it's a tough it's a tough decision for these small communities and um hopefully um yeah and it's sometimes there's money available and, and there's there's a lot of public safety grants out there um and a lot of community groups and foundations that want to that want to outfit our first responders so it's um mm -hmm. i mean i would I, I would look into those before i would start to cheap out on 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 a session on essential equipment KB9 VBR antennas are simple, effective, and affordable VHF and UHF antennas for amateur radio, MERS, public safety, and GMRS. Made in the USA with quality parts. Get yours online at jpol-antenna.com.